Well. So it wasn't a bad dream. What well, wasn't a bad dream? The zombies. No, no. no. I mean, I've just been standing here. <laughs> the whole night? Wait, how long has passed? It, um... That's odd. That's some kind of weird time distortion here, is it? Is it daylight savings time where you are? I don't know. It's. It looks like noon. Wait, that's not right. Well, as close as you can tell with uh, this place. Yeah, I mean, that's... That's very odd. Well, we're, we can worry about it later. Yeah, let's see. Let's just get to this try to help these people out here, because, you know, they need somebody with superpowers. Just whatever I can do. Now you are a sight for sore eyes. What are you up to? Well, I don't mind telling you this makes no damn sense to me. And I hate to be the one drawing a blank on Final Jeopardy. But right now, folks just need me to look like I got all the answers. The questions, they come later, along with the grieving. Then, after a little time, folks will lose their hankering for the questions. Fact is, a few of them in high places get downright evasive about it. I never do quit. It's a bad habit. I'm just a sheriff, after all, not some forensic detective like on that CSI. Thought I had it the worst when the Ravens came around years ago. What about the Ravens? It was time for Kingsmith. Not the kind that makes it to the news. The kind we keep inside. Um, I remember seeing some rather unnerving Ravens on my way here. You are right to be unnerved. Now, I see those Ravens are all back in town. They with you? Or should I bring them in for questioning? Ravens are no laughing matter, Helen. What? What's up with the ravens? Don't you know about ravens? Ravens are wicked smart. They can remember your face for years. If, if you wrong a raven, they will get all the whole flock together and just scratch your eyes out like you're in the birds. Jeez. Or birdemic for the new kids. I just know about one for sorrow, two for joy, three for girl, four for a boy... And how the rest of that Common Crow song goes. I don't remember that one. Was it was it on like was it like a hidden track? No, no, it was like a shit, I can't remember any the thing is like um I can't remember anything else about it, huh. Was your family eighteenth century witches? Not this century. What about the eighteenth century? I there are some questions about my ancestry that I would prefer to move on about. Okay. okay. That's the link. Well, sure wasn't an ideally budget to put the town under martial law. No, the good old boys on the council were all about thrifty spending, at least above the table. So I squirreled away where I could for some surveillance equipment. Police business, sure. Uh, let's call it civic awareness. I'm talking your webcams, your motion sensors... Oh, don't look so surprised. Kingsmith might be out in the sticks, but we have electricity and everything. Running water and tourist season. Come back when this whole damn mess is blown over, I'll give you the tour far as the old lighthouse. But, uh, to get to the point of it, seems to me we should bring that gear out of mothballs and get it hooked up around town. Gives me some early warning and the others a break from my collection of Jeopardy reruns. Who does reruns of Jeopardy? I mean, you, someone has to, otherwise couldn't put, like, funny Jeopardy moments up on YouTube. You know somebody actually tried, like, the keyboard Zella thing from Family Guy? The what? On, you know, on Jeopardy, Adam West had wrote down keyboard Oh, Zella yeah, 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 I remember that. And sent Alex Trebek back to his home dimension. Yes. Did not work in real life. Did he actually say it out loud, though? He did. Oh. But he pronounced it wrong. Oh, I see. Yeah. He's a tricky bastard, but we'll get him. Ah, <sighs> wait. Is he actually a... Well, he's Canadian, so... Okay. Let's move on. Oh, God. Look at the streets in this... Arkham, Belmont, King's Court... 
Lovecraft Lane. Oh, look at the names of H.P. Arts and Crafts, H. Dunwick Newspapers. Jack and Wendy's, that's subtle. Okay, I don't know what Pan the Clan is, but I just have a sudden feeling of apprehension. Ugh. Yeah, I just got a shiver up my spine for some reason. No, right? And I heard a voice saying, whoa, Black Betty. Oh, dear God. <sighs> okay. So, let's see what my map says. Looks like the Slyco gas station is the first stop on our shopping list. I uh, can't get away from our roach anywhere. Yeah, they own just about everything, don't they? Uh, yeah, I mean, they're even worse than Disney. Well, yeah, Disney owns a lot of stuff, but, like, I don't think they own weapons manufacturers. Well, you don't think that. Oh. Trust me, there are a lot of military uses for Imagineering. I bet. Oh, that thing just looks creepy. Oh my god, oh. that's not a nose. What? Yeah. It's a oh my god, I never noticed that before. Oh, I always thought that thing was the... I always thought that was the nose, and that was the smile. But now that's the... Maybe they're both mouths. Oh god. What is... That's a... I know some people don't like how Pixar does it with the eyes and the windshield, but that is too far in the other direction. Jeez. Um, Hold on a second, I got a weird feeling over here. What are you, in the spider sense going off? Yeah. Like there's something big. Well, bees like you can detect abnormally strong energy sources. Like this? Yeah, like that's that is the textbook photo for an for abnormally strong. Oh shit. It's it's making noises like someone's raping a donkey. Uh, what is it eating over here? Something spilled. Oh. Lots of it's, it's like just a puddle of nacho cheese. Nah. Or possibly kerosene. What are those? Are those just bricks? Those are cans of bingo. No, 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 not those. Oh, yeah, those are bricks. Why do they put a bunch of bricks in a trash can? You know, I went down to the archives in here once, looking for, like, something on, you know, an old building, you know, owned by, like, I don't know, Sam Krieg or something. One folder just had a brick in it. How did a folder have a brick in it? It was a big folder. It just had bricks from one of his houses. I... I don't know why we needed the brick. They wouldn't let me take it home. Another brick in the wall. <laughs> I think someone tried to make a stand up here. I guess they are probably disappointed when they opened that box yeah. of ammo and found only, like, only bullets instead of, you know, shells. Wonder what happened to them. I don't know. Oh wait, I think I spotted them. Wait, what the hell? How did? No, no, that's not that. No way. They how did? They... What? How did it even happen? Maybe he climbed up to do a fun little apocalypse prank on the sign. You see that? Yeah, but then like. He... He must have got trapped up there or something. <laughs> How did he get Are burned? I mean, I'll say that car crashed into here and exploded. And I mean, I everything blew up there. I don't think it could have like blown him onto that sign. This is. There's a helicopter. Whose helicopter is that? Where did it? Where did it go? More importantly, where did they come from? Cotton Eye Joe. Oh, I got a yard sale! Oh, yeah, cool. Oh, let's go check it out. Oh, what the fuck is that? Oh, what the... That is not a normal zombie. Yeah, that's not a zombie. What is that? Looks like the fish pirates from the, from the second Pirates of the Caribbean movie. Where are they going? Oh, there must be something over there. 
Oh, is he coming? Is he coming after me? Oh shit! Well, he took the long way around. Oh crap! Oh. There's another one of them. Quick, um, uh, maybe there's stairs. I go back this way. Oh shit! Debbie, I don't think you can take this thing. Just run. Okay, fine. Okay. Oh shit! Wrong direction. Oh. No. What the hell? Okay. Okay, Debbie. Head. The zombie puke on me. To your left. Oh, it's burning. What? No, not. Oh shit! Got. Last thing I remember, I was fighting those big green things and some zombies and down by the pier, and then. Am I. Wait, what's. What is this play? This is the, this is the sheriff's hospital. So everything's different. It feels like I'm underwater. Where is everybody? Where is every... What? Hey, hey buddy, you there? You... Oh my god. See a ghost? Uh, am I a ghost? I don't think I made it. I think I'm... I think I'm dead. Oh my god, I'm... I'm dead? Is this is what death being dead is like? I just uh, What well, I can't be dead right now. I just started. I just I just got out of here. I just started this new life with these superpowers and now I'm already dead? I I already fucked it up so badly I'm dead? Hello? What the f hell I'm just don't I don't I can't be dead already. Hello? I, uh, I screwed things up so bad already. I just I mean, people need me. And is this the light? Is this the light I'm supposed to go towards? Debbie, I don't want to give up. This is giving up. Debbie, but I don't want to. Debbie, is that you? <laughs> yeah, it's me. Debbie, what? oh my god. I don't. What? Listen. What are you doing? How the fuck can I hear you? Look, it's. Okay, okay, good, good, you're, well, you, you're with, I'm dead, I'm dead, oh. I'm dead, and I don't know, I'm a ghost, Deb I don't, I don't want to stand up, I saw that another ghost, and he was just standing there staring at the wall, and just go blank, and I, I don't, I don't want to be like that, but I don't want to go, Debbie, up the light either, because that was just giving up, and I don't, oh god, I don't even make sense anymore, Debbie, listen, listen to me, you're, I mean, you're kind of a ghost, but you're not dead. <laughs> How can I be a ghost if I'm not dead? It's, it's complicated. Listen, you can come back. What do you? All you have to do. What are you? All you have to do is step into the light, Debbie. What? What? Am I, what I'm dead. And I'm, I fucked up. Debbie, I fucked up, and I can never get it back. It's not over, Debbie. It's not over. It's not over. I'm dead. No. dead. Dead is over. Dead is the end. It's not the end. If you step into the light, you'll come back. You'll come back to life. Yeah, it's like a, it's like a, it's like a worm or something. No, no, you'll be you. You'll be you. I promise. What? How does that, does that work? That doesn't make any sense. I'm dead. I can't come back. Look, Debbie, you're a magical, you're a magical woman with superpowers and a bee inside your head, and you can come back from the dead. What? Look, okay, I'm gonna try. I don't want to go. And I just. I'm alive. I'm alive. Oh you're, you're right. I'm alive. <laughs> I, I, 
came back to life? What? Oh, shoot. <laughs> <laughs> you, you asshole! Why didn't you tell me sooner? I, you knew that I could come back and you didn't tell me? I did tell you! You didn't tell me before I died? Oh. Okay, yeah. Yeah, shit. Ugh. What the fuck?! Do you think that was important? Uh... Oh, God. Oh, fuck this, I'm out of here! Fuck you! Oh, I... Uh... Oh. Fuck. No, oh, they're not gonna be happy about this. I know you're still there, but I don't, but I don't care. Too much going wrong for such a little island. But this is how it always starts. And I've borne witness more times than I care to remember. Begins with a single act. Usually someone being damn stupid, damn greedy, or both. Let me tell you, kid. That kind is the worst kind. Then, then it just piles on and piles on. And once that cellar door's open, ain't no one witching the damn thing shut again. And you won't find ordinary people in a place like Solomon Island. They've all been touched. Because, see, here's the thing about the secret world. It's the kind of secret that spreads kind of sticks. Hell, that's how myth and legend got going. On a whisper. Passed door to door, going viral. Mighty dangerous things to get into people's heads. That's why most myths are 99% warning. Yeah, about as effective as the ones they slap on a packet of smokes. I come from the South, the real old South. My partner Wolf and I ride for a higher authority. When you need to know us, you'll know us. You got a whole lot to learn about the secret world first, kid. And when you're all learned up, then you gotta understand what you learn. Kinda like peeling the layers off an onion. Probably be as much weeping involved, too. Won't lie to you. Won't talk down to you, neither. You and me, we're the same. I'm just more experienced, is all. And experience don't count for much these days. We've been stretched out thin as gauze. And we need all the cool heads and steady hands we can get. Thought I had a measure of the absolute darkness in this world. The darkness waiting its turn. Patient as all hell to come through. Turns out I was wrong. So, guess we both got some learning to do. So, Illuminati. Huh. You guys have been missed around these parts. Just take a look and see. Put on one hell of a homecoming parade for you. Now, I saw a head office sweeping the shit under the rug on TV. But if they sent you out, I guess they're trying corporate responsibility on for size, huh? Only, they don't really do responsibility now, do they? No, they I don't understand. Don't. <laughs> it's the pioneer spirit of the American century. Home of the brave and all. I'd sure be the one to talk now, wouldn't I? Or is it because the Templars are digging here now and sniffing at old bones? I reckon they've been waiting a long time for the Illuminati to slip up. Ain't no quarrel like an old-fashioned quarrel. Now, you listen, kid, I ain't here to pass no judgment. Find the measure yourself. And if it should match up with the company you keep, well, then I'll tip my hat to you. Society 
is what keeps us apart from the dark. Did you just receive a uh, motivational lecture from an old cowboy? Nobody does that better than old cowboys. Uh, haven't you ever seen the Big Lebowski? Yeah, but I mean, he didn't really do lectures in there, did he? You're at the end, but you know what? I guess your point, and you know what? <sighs> I'm sorry, I, I didn't just... know. I just didn't want to think no. about another dude dying. But, you know, we if we can't die... Sometimes... Sometimes they don't come back. She gave you strength to rend the lion. Now eat the honeyed entrails because it is good, because it is sweet, because it is terrible. Initiate the Samson prerogative. Out of the eater comes what is eaten, and out of the strong comes what is sweet. I guess even the bees are telling me to go back. The bees know their shit. 